Many, many years ago, when TV ruled the advertising world, the Big Coffin Coal Brands dominated the flu category. In those days, big budgets were the most powerful weapons, so only the biggest and strongest brands could survive. But one day in 2014, a brand by the name of Bonington's Irish Moss, with its $100,000 budget, discovered an illuminating insight to expose a weakness amongst his competitors. The big brands did the same big TV campaigns every year. However, the flu season is anything but rigid. It varies drastically by year and by market. With this insight, Bonington's devised a strategy to turn around the year-on-year -year sales declines of 20%. He set about predicting the ever-changing flu season to ensure his advertising was only seen in market when Australians were actually sick, therefore maximising receptivity to his message. The execution involved ingesting five data sets, including nine years of search data. One year of brand search, a direct weather feed from the Bureau of Meteorology, along with Facebook and Twitter chatter. Through regression and correlation analysis, he could now understand the relationship of these data sets to predict the flu season. He only had one shot, but with the flu tracker, he was ready and waiting for the flu season to hit. By connecting the flu tracker to a programmatic trade desk, he was able to trigger marketing in real time to ensure all investment took place as soon as influenza began to peak by region. By targeting sick Australians with real-time data-driven communication, Bonington succeeded in defeating Goliath, improving share of voice by 86% and driving a 23% increase in sales, which continued well beyond the campaign period.